days of uh, political toing and froing, as you say, this drama beginning back on Thursday when the Parliament first began trying to elect a new president. But round after round of balloting failed to produce a winner and with a growing sense of crisis and controversy and disarray and in some desperation, the faction leaders turned to the man who's actually doing the job at the moment, the widely respected President Giorgio Napolitano. In the course of the morning, the faction leaders went up to the presidential palace and tried to persuade him not to retire but to stand again and renew his mandate and at the age of 87 he said as he put it he would make that sacrifice for the nation and very soon afterwards there was a fresh round of balloting in parliament and President Napolitano was re-elected with a, a huge majority those faction leaders standing and applauding in evident relief as uh, he achieved the required number of votes. But one major faction, the uh, citizens' protest movement, a major bloc in Parliament now, was vehemently opposed to this re-election for the citizen protest movement, this smacked of old-style politics, traditional parties making deals with a, an establishment figure. And while those faction leaders applauded out in the piazza outside Parliament, supporters of the protest movement chanted shame, shame.